with that cold front coming in and the heat and the humidity tomorrow, there is a risk for all of North Texas uh, is a level two slight risk on a one to five to see damaging wind gust potential and perhaps some hail golf ball size, possibly even larger in some instances. That's the concern for tomorrow. It's not a tornado day tomorrow though you can never rule one out. Uh, in North Texas ever with a severe weather setup, but this setup is much more conducive for very large hail and damaging wind potential. Tonight is quiet by early tomorrow morning. Some remnant thunderstorm activity may affect areas like Paris down through Mineola and Tyler, really East Texas. This is what we're going to be watching and a little disturbance along this front. Late tomorrow afternoon into the evening, this is 5 p.m. Watch this uh, model kind of blow up thunderstorms. Now, I tell everybody this all the time. This is just a model. It's just an idea. You know, if you live in Greenville, don't just bank on it thunderstorming at 7 p.m. And then if you live in Fort Worth, say, oh, I'm good. It's not going to storm here at 7. Where these thunderstorms pop up exactly is always a question until it happens. That's how it works. So we do expect thunderstorms to start erupting ahead of the cold front at seven. They'll become more numerous by eight, nine, and then so on and so on at 10 o'clock. These thunderstorms, again, could produce hail up to golf ball size, possibly larger in some instances. We saw tennis ball size hail uh, just a couple of days ago with a couple of storms in Denton County. It's that time of the year. Secondary severe weather season is already here. Thunderstorms still ongoing at 10 p.m. Now, a second round is possible along this front. Watch what happens by about midnight. So you see thunderstorms ongoing from Navarro County and east. Then a few more storms may start to spark up late Sunday into very early. And we're talking the overnight hours. Overnight Sunday into early Monday morning. There's 2 o'clock in the morning. Uh, there's three, so we'll still be watching thunderstorm activity through possibly even daybreak on Monday. There's 7 a.m. Cold front will clear the area. Monday looks relatively quiet with clearing skies, but again, that severe weather threat is, is amplified late tomorrow afternoon through the night. Make sure you stay with us for the latest. Also, the heat advisory. Heat index up to 110 tomorrow afternoon. It's crazy. These are the actual high temperatures. We expect to break a record. The record is 99 uh, set back in 1907. We have 101 in the forecast for Dallas and 100 in Denton, 100 in Waxahachie. So a hot day tomorrow. Warm tonight, muggy 79. Tomorrow, 100 degrees. Make sure you stay tuned tomorrow. Tune in, 530. We'll be here, and we'll be here all night tracking this. Uh, that's probably the best rain chance we'll see for at least the next two weeks. Once we get into the 14 day forecast, no serious relief from the heat. We do go from 100 Sunday to 87 Monday, 88 on Tuesday, but we stay pretty warm overall.